Hi guys, we are going to see BFD. BFD means variable variable frequency drive. First, we going to see what's mean by variable frequency drive in motor. having a very different various different types of speed control first one is voltage speed control second one is uh, variable of resistance third one is induction method fourth one is frequency method fifth one is synchronous method in lot of method we have a what we have a lot of method to control the motor speed the one of the method of variable frequency method today we are going to see that method the variable frequency drive in variable frequency drive what we are going to do how to we going to change the frequency in 50 hertz for example in 50 hertz how do we change this one for to any of the frequency uh, 25 hertz to 100 hertz how do we going to change this method we have a lot of method but we are going to see today for electronic based how to change the frequency mostly we are going to use for diode for changing the voltage of AC to DC here we are going to change the voltage in alternative current to direct current we take three phase supply and here in the three phase supply R Y B in the two diodes are working in reverse and forward method to change the voltage in AC to DC then we are going to rectify the ripples by using this capacitor ripples capacitor then we are going to any of the transistor families uh, like a mosfet or fed or j bjp bjt these are the any of the transistor we are going to use in here to change the change the voltage from dc to and ac in between the gap we are going to how the change the frequency from low frequency to in high frequency this is happened by timing signal that means the timing signal is same like this come here in here three terminals same like this three parts in come here the, the timing signal of gate this one is gate this gate signal getting timing signal to uh, activate the transistor then only we got the output from here so that how the changes of in timing signal to we got the output from here in this timing signal signal to we change the frequency if in case we have a lot high frequency motor is run in low if in here we have a low frequency motor is run in high how it happen uh, frequency is inversely proportional to speed that's why we are getting this result that's all guys this is what we are using all always using for some uh, this this type of uh, displays uh, and uh, this is for input and output these are the type we use for VFT panels next section we going to see how the VFT we are configured uh, this is for very simple method to um, explain uh, I think you got uh, some good points from this video if you like this video please subscribe thank you very much guys